Hello. Um. Me. Uh. So. I've been wanting to do a video diary like this for a while. Uh. And I'm just going to let my mind wander. Because honestly, you know, therapists have said it would be a good thing. Um. In order to better articulate my feelings. But I have this problem with doing things like this. I end up feeling like a huge narcissist. Now, you know, the weird thing about that is probably... I have probably, like, the worst self-esteem out of anyone you know. Well, I know. I'm not sure if I want to put this online. That's another thing I'm trying to work on is you know, putting myself out there, uh, yeah. I've never been particularly good with, um, people, uh, I like to think quite a bit, but recently I've been hiding from my own thoughts through, you know, music and videos and more rarely than I'd like to say books, uh, you know, I used to, I got, I got, gotta look at myself in the mirror, so to speak, okay, so, I, I used to, I used to like reading books a lot, but recently, uh, I can't, it's not even that I can't focus on it if I wanted to, it's that I don't even get to that stage. You know what I mean? Like, um, like, I'll be here and I'll be guilting myself about not going up to, you know, go and read that book. Uh, or I'll be guilting myself about you could be doing something more constructive right now, but then, when it comes down to it, I just rather wouldn't do anything. And I feel like that's that's part of my circumstance right now. Uh, I mean, I try my best, and I'm always trying, honestly. Like, it's a constant thing. Like, I actually, on the whiteboard back there, is uh, this stupid thing that I had the idea of, like, when I was in eighth grade, and I have been trying to get my asshole self to actually follow through and do it and it's called what is it i can't even remember uh the the helios project which was this idea which was the first uh i had this idea where it would be like um a tangent of graph of ideas uh, so, like, it would be an exercise for the brain, and then I was like, hey, maybe I should try making a, a web page that did this in a cool fashion, and then Google's Knowledge Graph came out, and it kind of, you know, shat on my life. Uh, but it, it's still a fundamental exercise. You take one subject, and you make connections. You, like, you would put, uh, the sun, and then, uh, you would be like, what aspects do you know of in the sun? So mythology would be like Helios, and then Helios would connect to maybe the color, uh, and then, you know, Helios, uh, blah, you, you know, you get the idea. I'm not even talking to anyone. I'm just trying to talk because, um, you know, my entire life, I haven't really had friends. I mean, I did okay at school, uh, after, you know, middle school, I, I kind of, I was kind of bullied throughout all that, and it just, we all are a little bit, I mean, but I was weird, I mean, I'm still weird, but, uh, there's, there's all that shame, um, bearing down and keeping me in this normal realm, like, I used to have really long hair, and I used to like a lot but, uh, between my dad and all of the insecurity and, you know, 
other things. Um, yeah, I ended up finally giving in for the second time. Well, yeah, second time. Uh, and I cut it short. I kind of like it now. Uh, I think it was mainly to hide my face. Uh, I, I just didn't like... I, I just didn't like being seen, I guess. And everyone's always been like, oh, you're not unattractive. And I, I, I recognize that I'm not unattractive, per se, on a, on a good day. I'm not unattractive, but I... I always feel like I am. I, I feel, you know, wrong no matter what shape I take. I mean, sometimes, you know, I can find comfort by looking in the mirror. Um, but that's a whole different situation. That's just trying to, like, get out of this dissociative state that, like, I'm generally in, which is, like, I feel normally, like, looking at the camera at me right now, I mean, I think it's all of us, but I, I am so deep in thought constantly about everything until recently. It just freaks me out because I recognize that uh, I'm not like, I'm not visualizing my body. So I try to do that and then I, it just ends up in this really weird perspective. And, you know, perspective is a funny thing. I hurt this girl that I was with for two whole, you know, years. She was like the real first serious relationship I had. And she was, you know, she was kinder to me than any person I've ever met in my entire life. She made me feel like I belonged. And normally I have my head on my shoulders pretty good. I mean, I, I've always been that pretentious asshole who's criticizing everybody from the sidelines. I mean, I don't tell anyone because I don't have anyone to t tell. But, like, I'm always the guy who's, like, the wallflower who's just, you know, secretly hating everyone because I, I can't be like them. Like, I want to. I mean, I, I've tried going to parties, but it's just not fun to me. I, d I don't know how to get into that mode. It's just not who I am, and I wish that could be who I am, because it, it would be a lot funner than, you know, being sort of trapped in my own head. But back to the point, uh, you know, I got really comfortable for the first time in my life with her. And because of that, I actually did become an asshole. And I, I see how relationships fall apart now after you know, how, how I treated her. And I mean, it wasn't anything particular that I did. It was just all these little things that I recognized later on that the real me, like myself, never would have done. But I can't take that back. And there's no way to, you know, apologize for how I acted. I mean, I pay for it every night. It just, and he, I even tried telling her that, uh, that, that I felt horrible, that I, I wish I could do anything in the world to take away, you know, the hurt, but, uh, you know, I, I think it's just better that she forgets me, and I'm sure she feels that way too. I just couldn't let go of it because it was the first real human connection that I had with a person, you know, and I lost that. And it was my fault. It was, and, you know, it's not even hard to say that. It's just hard to think about how they aren't going to be around when I imagined them in so much of my life. You know. I can, uh... try and move on, but it's a little hard when you don't... talk to people, really. 
And it's probably, you know, my fault. I do that a lot. I, I say things are my fault too much. And, you know, that was one of the, the problems. I mean... I guess I just need to work on a lot of things. And I'm trying to do that, but, you know, when I don't have anyone to talk to, I, uh, I kind of just zone out and become something other. And, uh, it's almost like I don't exist for periods of time. I mean, I'm not, well, I'm a little crazy. Um, like, not, not the, like, destructive crazy, self-destructive crazy a little bit, to be honest. But I've always had, you know, I mean, I've had my selfish moments, but, uh, I regret them infinitely afterwards, and, you know, I've kind of yeah, it is my choice. I've, I've taken myself out of human situations recently because it's just... I don't even want to take the chance with hurting people. And, you know... Uh, the hardest part, probably, was the fact that, like I said earlier, I've, I've never really had friends. I had to try so hard to get into this fucking stupid alt kid group. Ugh. And, uh, you know, I had to act like I liked music that I didn't. It's all, all, all the normal middle school stuff. I, in all honesty, it never ended up really panning out. I mean, I did join marching band, and that ended up being pretty fun. But, uh, you know, it was nice having friends for a little bit. It was. I mean, I do, I do still have, uh, probably two or three really good friends, which honestly is what most people say about, you know, life is like, you get a couple really good friends, but I, you know, thought she was going to be one of them. I guess I was wrong. Well, I was the one who messed that up. Let's move on. So. Uh, not I guess. I did. Okay. Um, but, you know, the hardest thing to deal with was, you know, finding out what it was finally like to have friends. And then, you know, having to give it up again. But honestly, I was glad it happened. I was glad I experienced it. And I think at least for a little while, that's enough for me. Because I like who I am. Just kind of that distant observer person. Person. Character. Whatever you would call it. Um... I, I kind of like being detached. I mean, I'm anything but detached. Uh, I, I have a wide range of feelings that I constantly go through. I mean, now they're in this weird perspective where it's like... No, it's still first person. I mean, you know that moment when you're analyzing yourself and, you know, your own perception of you changes? Wow, I went on a tangent for so long. Okay. No, what this was supposed to originally be was me saying, um, you know, how I became an asshole. Um, you know, I feel like healthy self-esteem is kind of a bad thing sometimes. I mean, you know, even when it's not bordering on narcissism, because you're not criticizing yourself. And, uh... You know, when you're not doing that, you can become careless, and you can hurt the people around you. And, uh, honestly, I, 
after after doing that it's the last thing I want to do anymore so I want to make sure the next time I engage with a person not get engaged um, you know friendship wise or in crazily maybe one day because I need I'm I feel like I would not want to take the chance with a relationship because I don't want to be that person again I don't I want to make sure the next time I uh, commit to something like that that I'm the best version of me that I can be and that I make that other person happy and that I let them know every single day how happy they make me but I don't know, man. Good luck with life. Because it's fucking crazy. Like, it's fucking crazy. Like, you become a different person in a second. And then months have gone by and you just ask yourself, like, why did I even... Why did I even do it? And I mean, most of the time, it, it, it it's kind of fear driving me, at least. But, uh, you know, that's some Freudian bullshit that I won't get into, because that was supposed to be the, the signing off bullshit. So, we'll see if I post this. I'll work on it.